Hello and welcome to Vision Academy. My name is Hanuman Tadwa and in this video we are going to write a program to concatenate two strings in C. Let us write the preprocessor directives hash include in angular brace we will write standard input output dot h header file. The next preprocessor directive is hash include in angular brace we will write console input output dot h header file and the next preprocessor directive is hash include in a angular brace we'll write string dot h header file so here we are using concatenation that is str cat built in function so that's the reason we have to include string dot h header file so str cat function is a built in function which is present in this particular header file so concatenation means combining two strings together here Concatenation means string 2 will come and join at the end of string 1. So let us write wide main function curly open brace and here I am going to declare and initialize two string variables. I will write char type of data s1 of size 10 that is it is array of characters that is nothing but string. So using assignment operator in a double quotation mark, I'm going to write sun and the double quotation mark and put semicolon. So sun is a string constant. What is string? String is a sequence of characters enclosed within a pair of double quotation mark is called string. Now let us write the second string. So char s2 of 10 is equal to in a double quotation mark, I'm going to write flower. So here string 2 will come and join at the end of string 1. So that forms sunflower. So now let us use the built-in function to concatenate. Here I am going to write str cat function and we need to pass both of these two string constants s1 comma s2 and put semicolon. Now after this we have to print the concatenated string. In a printf statement, I am going to write in a double quotation mark concatenated string is percentage s and the double quotation mark put comma s1. Why s1? Because string 2 will come and join at the end of string 1. Hence, the updated string that is the concatenated string is present in s1. So, that is the reason we have to write here s1. Now, we will write get ch function and curly closing brace. Now let us run this program and check out how exactly the output comes. So here we will take an example. Once we compile and run this program, it is going to directly print concatenated string is S1. Here both of these two string will be initialized to both S1 and S2 of type character. STR CAT will combine both the strings together. String 2 will come and join at the end of string 1 without leaving any space. Here it is going to print concatenated string is concatenated string is this percentage S is associated with S1. So S1 consisting of sun flower S. Yes. So let us run this program. For that, I will take you to my laptop screen. Here you can see I have already written this program in Turbo C++ compiler to save your time. And here you can see I have declared array of character that is first string and initialized with the string constant sun. In the same way, I have declared one more string of type character that is string only. The second string is having the string constant flower. Now let us compile this program by pressing Alt F9. So it is showing success that indicates there is no syntax error. I'm going to press enter and now we are going to run this program by pressing Ctrl F9. Here you can see it is showing the result as concatenated string is sun flower combined together. Here Flower is string 2, sun is string 1. Flower string 2 has come and join at the end of string 1. 
i hope you understood this program if so please write down in the comment box as understood thank you